Hello everyone, and welcome once again to Let's Play Thief Deadly Shadows with Frozen Foxy. We are now about to enter the Hammerite Clock Tower. And, uh, this happens to be one of the more interesting levels because it's very, um, vertical when you start out. So, uh you got to make sure that you get the loot before you really uh, start going down because it's um, not very easy to go back up. Also, uh, you don't want to get uh, smacked around by one of these large uh, clocky things. Builder, let my hand strike true. Builder in the work I do. Oh, shut up. These machines could crush me flat. That's right, Garrett. Better keep on my toes. I better. So, um, for this first part, we are going to be looking for 19 pieces of loot, which will be about 65%. Ah, here's our first piece of loot. Lovely. And, uh, it looks like an arrow here, but, uh, for some reason I can't grab it, and I don't particularly care. Alright. Let's see what this hammer's up to. Okay. Careful not to be bashed by that thing. Oh. And oh, there's another one over there. A. A. B C D E F G. Something like that. Was that what you were going for? I'm not really sure. All right. Oh, there's the other. Oh, I see something shimmering over in that corner. Mm, odd noise. It was an odd noise, wasn't it? Oh, that um is not supposed to be on the floor like that. Um, yeah. You won't see that on the floor like that. Normally that diamond gear is all the way up here. Um, I don't know why it fell to the floor like that. That's fine though. At least um, everyone knows where it's supposed to be. Um, okay. Uh, ooh, look at that. Holy water. You can always use holy water. Never know when a zombie's gonna come out of somewhere. Not that I ever really use holy water. And down we go. Let's see. I'm sure there might be something over that way, but I don't really want to risk getting smacked around. So we're going to go down the ladder instead. Oop, another hammer right down here. Gotta be careful. Uh, Okay. Where is he going to go? Oh. Coming over this way. Well, as long as I don't come out of the shadows, I should be fine. Alright, here we go. Hey! Whoops. I know thou art here. I know I'm here too. Um, how about not? How about the builder strike you down because I don't really like you? I've already escaped. Obviously, hammers don't know how to climb up ladders. Uh, I don't know what it is, but those, those hammers aren't very good at climbing. Well, are you gonna give up or not? Sound like you're bouncing over there. Gee, this is not a very good start to this level. I shouldn't have got I sick. shall find the villain, and you know it. Do I? Do I really? Uh oh. Next time, villain. Next careful, time. Careful. I didn't realize he was still right there. Well. Ah, there we go. I think he's moving away now. All right. 
Let's be more careful this time around. That wasn't a very good way to go after him. Uh, let's see. Your hammers are so funny. Various odd noises you make. Ooh, look, loot. That's one and two. Oh, I think this is a map. I don't know about Lovely. stopping time, but this should let me stop the clockworks. So, we are now at three pieces of loot out of the 19 that we need. And a book. Journal of Father Dimbole. Any smith canst divide an ingot into twenty and four pieces of equal weight. Any forger can split a rod into sixty shavings, set them to a bolt. Tis good work, but common. Only these brethren in mine keeping can split a day into twenty-four... Uh, excuse me, twenty and four pieces. Can split an hour into sixty shavings of equal time. He hath set his will not against our success, but against our sloth. So must we be shaped ever stronger in his forge. But tis at times overmuch for me, and I seek the remedy I have purchased for myself at great cost. The alchemy of time hath made of the grape a solace for the builder's trials. None but mine own lips shall taste of it. To name myself his tool as greater than the work, t'was Charis's folly and sin. And I shalt not follow that path, t'was also the folly of Greedus, and t'was punished for it. For no sooner hadst he issued invitation to all to witness as he drank from the chalice, then was it stolen away. Yes, we did that stealing. Also, Charis is uh, basically the main boss, uh, well, I suppose you can call him a boss, um, over in uh, Thief to the Metal Age. Interestingly enough, uh, it was played by the same person who voices Garrett. Yes, he's got uh, many, many voices. Anyway, uh, this journal was talking about Solace, which uh, is basically drink, and he said that um, no one would taste of it, so perhaps it's hidden somewhere? Somewhere? Oh, well, would you look at that? Hello? I believe I found the solace. Ooh, a chest. With some loot. Aha. Now we are at four pieces. Yes, we're getting much closer. Hello, rat. I don't know how you got in here, but you're my only friend. A locked door. Well, I don't really care for locked doors, and therefore I'm just going to go through the window. It's much easier. Ah. Moss arrow. Alright. Who could be in here? Hmm, I see someone. Ooh, he's got something on his belt. Now, just let's get close enough to get it. Yes. There we are. That's five pieces of loot. Will he notice? Maybe. Maybe. Where is? Has I been robbed? Oh, I don't know. Maybe you have. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, look a mine over there. Um, let's see. Will he turn around? No. Okay. Let's move forward. 